Good morning, I'm going to talk for a couple of minutes about machining some curves on the lathe. Machining curves on a manual lathe can be quite difficult. If you want to make a small radius, like this for example, then you could make a form tool, but you would need to make a different form tool for each size radius that you wish to cut. And if the piece was particularly large, the size of the tool would become impractical and at the very least would chatter a lot. I'm going to demonstrate the lathe curve software that makes this job simple and quite fun to do. The tool calculates a series of cuts to make using a normal right hand cutting tool to give you a smooth sure how well you're going to see this but I'll uh, bring the tool up over a very snowy Stansted Airport background. You'll see it does all the usual things, bow circles quads, triangles. Uh, we're going to look at the lathe curve tool. This brings you up an array of uh, options to cut a radius, a cosine, a socket, curved bore. We're just going to cut a radius. Save it to the default file. Inside diameter. I've just put an inside diameter of uh, 10 millimeters outside of 28 and we're going to do it in 18 cut. That'll give us a fairly coarse finish. Let's just do that calculation for now. So let's save the coordinates to a file. Change that to 36. Do it again. Let's save it to the same file. This is the file that's produced. Firstly, the 18 cuts in half mil steps, and then the 36 cuts in quarter mil steps. Gives you the step number. The start X is obviously always starting from zero point and how far to cut along, in this case 4.4983 millimeters and positioning of the Y which is the cross slide on the lathe. So we simply take that file off to the lathe, make a series of cuts and we end up with our radius we can make a cosine cut which is a slightly uh, gentler slope. This is a cosine cut. Uh, I've deliberately left it coarse so that you can see how the tool works. It iterates by a series of cuts cutting there, gradually getting closer to the center and adjusting the distance that you cut down to so you get a series of iterations. If this is a coarse cut you can see that it's in uh, small steps. You then do a finer cut to uh, smooth that up and you can finish it with a piece of emery paper or wire wool to uh, polish it right up to a nice smooth finish. You can use the internal uh, calculator to calculate a ball socket for example, go to machinerycalculator.mysmarttools.com, which I'll show you below, 
and uh, have a look for yourself.